I am going to teach you how to use a specific model from Civitai InfoOcus. I assume that you have installed FOOCUS from the GIT repository. Now we have to find a model. For that example, I am going to use models from Civitai.com. Now I am going to find the model named Vector Illustration. The first one is the model that I want to select. I should click over it. We can see examples of that model. We have an example of a hamburger, a car, a soup, a bus, and a snowman. In the details section, we can identify that the model is Laura type. The creator has left us some tips. The main ones are that the weight is between 0.6 and 0.9, and generate images with 500 to a 5 to dimensions. I am going to continue downloading the model by clicking on the download button. The download model might paste it into the LoRa folder, which is located in Fayukas and Models folder. We should open Fayukas in the browser, and we have to configure the parameters. To do, this is necessary to check the advanced option below of prompt input. Starting with the settings section, the preset should have a default value, the performance should have quality, and the aspect ratio should be selected. 500 Hermon 2 5 102. Remember the tip that the creator left on Civite website. We read it when downloading the model. The image number should be 6. I am going to paste the prompt text that concerns a girl in high school doing her homework. In the Style tab is necessary to uncheck Focus for all checked styles. In the Model tab, select the model named Vector Illustration and set Orfrolk 9 in Weight Input. Finally, it's time to generate the images by clicking on the Generate button. We have to wait a moment until the Fayukas has generated the six results that we defined. We can see the first results. From my point of view, it has a good quality is the result that I hopped. Three of the six results are really good, the details are great, and the colors are too. I was looking for a model to create vectorial illustration and that model has the characteristics that can help you to generate images for websites, mobile applications, presentations, social networks, or another type of implementation. Now enjoy the results and let me know what was your favorite result, comment, and subscribe to the channel.